Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. CEO and Cree here with a new video for y'all today. As always, please make sure to click that subscribe button down below so keep up with our new content. Now in today's video, as y'all can see, we have another Nuzlocke run. This is episode number 11 of our Nuzlocke run, Leaf Green. Let's go ahead and take a look at who we have right now in the party. We had some new additions last episode. So we added Pharaoh Yami to the team, as well as a Dark Legacy and Poke Pair. Uh, previously, we had added Thick Bayesh to the squad, and in addition to Thick Back, we also have Lil and Donnie Sins in the squad for today. Post last episode, between now, we went ahead and took care of the Underground Team Rocket stuff because there was nothing really too exciting there. Um, so we already defeated everyone, uh, including, I believe, Giovanni. Something we haven't done yet, of course, here in, what is this, Celadon City? We haven't gone up against Erica yet, and there are a lot of trainers in that gym, if I remember correctly. So, alright, time to fight Erica. Lovely weather. Not at the global warming. Leader Celadon, student of the art of flower arranging, solely grass type. Okay, solely grass type. Really though? Are they really solely grass type? Because it doesn't look- Level 29! Why is this Pokemon level 29 right now? Bro, 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 bro. I think Horn Drill is a one hit KO. And if it is, I'm freaking out right now. Uh... Fall in love with me, please. Please? Fall in love? Yes! Okay. Yes! Let's freaking go! No! Okay. Yes! Okay. Yes! Double yes. Double yes. Stop trying to use horn drill for the love of all things holy. Yes! Oh my goodness, yes. Yo, Fairy Yami, that freaking combo, the dynamic punch for confusion, plus having the trapped uh, to make a Pokemon of the opposite sex fall in love with you, and freaking toxic, or the sludge bomb, which sludge bomb which can poison Pokemon. Man, what a freaking fire combo. Now, super effective against a Cagnia, I think. Am I remembering wrong? I'm tripping. Might be tripping. Okay, 24. That's significantly better. I'm so much happier with that. It's an attack. This looks like it's a stat. That's an attack. Hmm. It's a very, very interesting attack. Oh no! Dang it, Erica, what the heck, man? Um. Crit? No, okay. Let's try magnitude. Magnitude 8, that's a good sign. I think the higher the number, the more, the more damage it does. Yes, okay. Boom, okay, chillin'. Alright, so Zap Cannon is our move. What does Foresight do again? I don't, I don't remember, but we'll, we'll check it if we need to. I don't know what that does. It's a really weird attack. I don't think it did anything at all. Ooh. That's not good. Uproar. No! 
Erica, what are you doing? It's super effective! Okay, Poke Pear. It needs to snap, just like snap out of it. Okay, no, we're fine. Stockpile, stockpile two. I'm a little worried because I don't know what that means. So where you see someone that you know and they ask you how you are, and you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine, but you just can't get into it because they would never understand. What are you freaking doing? Seriously, we're in the yellow? And now Pinsir's back in the yellow? Are you kidding me? All right. This might be it, but it might not. It's not. It's, oh God, paralyzed, it's something. Okay, I think we can take like two or three more leech hits and the and leech life's hits. Are you freaking kidding me? <sighs> okay. There we go. That was freaking ridiculous. That was freaking ridiculous. What the heck? <laughs> Alright. It's fine though, we did it. 1,242 experience points. That's fantastic. That's amazing. Rainbow badge. Okay, so um, there is a patch of grass that we have not gone to yet. All right, so this patch of grass we have not gone to yet. And we're about to see if we can add a new member to the team. Not a tentacruel. I did run into a tentacruel before, and it had a move. I can't remember the name of it, but I hope it doesn't have it. Bottom line, Memento. And it just kills itself automatically. Which, of course, we would never use in battle, but if it uses it, in this battle, we won't be able to catch it. And that would really suck. Um, so far, so good. Okay, so those are two out of four <laughs> moves. Hopefully, neither one of the other ones are... Yes! Okay, so far, it's not going bad. Three out of four moves are not Memento, which is good. It's actually doing some damage to corn though, which is not good. We don't like that. We love our corn. I think that's one of the three moves that we're familiar with. Um, at least one more attack, man. Come on. Yes. Okay, good. It missed. Should we do one more? Yeah, we should. It does have a Memento. We might actually be able to catch this. Um. Oh, no corn. Okay, we're gonna throw Donnie in because we don't want corn to, like, somehow get killed by this wild Pokemon. Um. Dang, this is a pretty tough tentacle that doesn't have a Mento, which is amazing. Um, blah, 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 blah. Hmm. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, we're gonna hold A. Oh. Two wiggle. Bruh. Bruh. Bruh, bruh, bruh. Okay, we're gonna try that again. Stage 2 level 22 Pokemon, come on, this would be very, very helpful if we can get this. A lot of 
every one of its attacks is like an attack, but also causes stat changes, like, or can like poison you. Like, this is actually a very clutch Pokemon right now. Come on. Yes! Okay. <laughs> Getting a little worried. I was like, man. All right. So, this is a shortened version, of course, but the, uh, his full name is Digital Pickaxe. Two words, Digital Pickaxe. He is a member of the Pokemon community. He, he does a bunch of giveaways on Twitter as of lately for a lot of Pokemon cards, so if anybody's interested in those, definitely check those out. So, definitely check out Digital Pickaxe. Again, Twitter, Twitch, uh, on, on all his uh, social media channels. Um, and, of course, win some free Pokemon cards. Who doesn't like that? So, that is now our tentacruel. Oh, we need to heal up right now. Okay, so we're back in Lavender Town right now. We're going to go up to Pokemon Tower. Now, we haven't actually encountered a Pokemon in this tower yet, so I think that the first Pokemon that we encounter, we should be able to catch. And if for whatever reason we're wrong on that, please call us out in the comments. But this should be our first actual Pokemon encounter. So when we were here before, it was just ghost, 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 ghost. So let's see what we can get. That is so freaking cool. 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 Oh. Please don't kill yourself. Okay. Dang, yo, that's kind of tough for a fifth, level 15 Marowak. Okay, we're fine. Um, let's... Go ahead and try this out. Great ball. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, well we said cool like a thousand times, so it's only fitting that we nickname our Marowak Cool Sheep. Who was also the coolest sheep. We highly recommend checking out her content because it's super awesome. She does variety streaming, so there can be anything from actual like Pokemon, Pokemon card unboxing, organizing, um, to even like some gameplay, Animal Crossing, um, or, or other games, um, Mario Kart, etc. Probably up on there too, it, to be. All right. Be gone, intruders. <sighs> okay, level 30, which is freaking insane. So it's an actual Marowak. Crap, and we're gonna try one of these. I don't have Marowak in the party, actually. That would have been really helpful to say. That did 40 damage. Uh, super motion. So I needed to use something that doesn't take away half of our HP. Yes. Nani? That works. I think it just took my move, bro. I'm not a fan. 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 Killing all of our super potions right now. If this is like more than 50 left, it's not. It's even stronger. Are you kidding me? 
Yo, this is a really, really tough Marowak. Um... Do we want to risk it for the biscuit? attacks are physical, are they? None of his attacks are physical. No, that was physical, wasn't it? Bro. Oh, wait, can I not even catch this? We can't catch this Pokemon. Crap, okay, well that, that, that just, you know, changes everything right now. And we just have to kill this Marowak. Crap. No, God! No, God, please, no! 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 This Marowak literally did not know Aeroblast. It sketched Aeroblast from Hungry Corn and then used that to kill Donnie. I don't want to play this game right now. What is happening? What is going on? What are you doing? Are you freaking kidding me? So strong. I can't even heal it. Like, there's no, there's no, there's no point of me changing right now. At least I don't think. Oh my freaking goodness, man! Please be match. Okay, it has to be enough. There we go. Mr. Fuji. Yes. There we go. Steve Green. Pokedex quest is one that requires strong dedication. Without deep love for Pokemon, your quest may fail. I'm not sure if this will help you, but I'd like you to have it. Definitely about to heal up. We have to do something that really freaking sucks. We have to get rid of release per Nuzlocke rules. Poke Pear and Donnie both fainted against that freaking insane Marowak. <sighs> and we have to get rid of them. We just got Poke Pear and we were so freaking excited. Y'all saw how excited we were that we got a Gyarados in this run, which is insane. Insane! It literally like evolved from an Eevee to a Gyarados right before our eyes for no reason. As 
soon as I told Donnie that I was going to do this freaking run, the first thing he said was, you better not let me die. And I've been doing so well not to let Donnie die. Uh, I don't want to click the button. I don't want to click this button, but we have to click the button. I'm just going to drink water. I'm going to look away and pretend like this isn't happening, like this is not real life. Definitely one of our craziest episodes ever. We did get a new gym badge, which was awesome. We got a couple new additions to the team, Digital Pickaxe and Cool Sheep. Really upset, but we're gonna keep, th that's part of the run, that's part of the challenge. Like these, th it happens and everything, cause you don't know what the Pokemon gonna, uh, that you're going up against are gonna have. There's always random advantages and disadvantages uh, throughout the entire run and you never know what's gonna happen. Uh, we did uh, get through the Pokemon Tower in Lavender Town. So we did get the Poke Flute, which is great. So we can actually maybe catch a Snorlax. Uh, but yeah, that's going to wrap up this episode. Again, all over the place, emotions all up and down. I'm so freaking sad right now, but I'm gonna try, you know, to. We're, we're gonna keep pushing through because, you know, we, there's still a lot to do. We still have a freaking amazing team. So we're gonna move on, you know, in memory of PokePair and Donnie Sins and everything. And as always, I wanna say uh, thank you to everybody for watching. I uh, appreciate all the love and support. And if you haven't subscribed yet, please subscribe to the channel so you keep up with our contents. Uh, we try to, you know, post giveaways, especially with these videos, so keep an eye on the description and our Twitter. As always, I hope you all staying safe, especially how crazy things are right now. Um, definitely want to make, make, make that a point, you know, please, 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 everybody stay safe. Again, uh, we wish the best for all of you. Appreciate all the love and support. And as always, we will see you next time.